Oh, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to more Mario 64. Today, we are going to deal with this place. We're going to go whenever it's... Four. <laughs> Tick-tock clock. Roll into the cage. Uh... Up. Yeet. Got him. Roll into the cage. I wonder what that's all about. Um. Up. Up. Eh. Up. Up. Alright, well, whatever reason, he just doesn't want to grab onto this one. Eh. Okay. Da da da. Ooh. Yeah, the eight coins, eight red coins are easy to get, so I'll worry about that another time. Let's see what's up here. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what star this is. <laughs> Just collecting random stars. Get a hand. All right. All right. So I want to go back at four again. Everything should be stopped then, right? Yes. <clears throat> Up. All right. Up. Oh. Bounced off the wall. I'll be back once I get back in there. <laughs> I went around and got more uh, lives just so I don't have to sit through the game over screen. Ah. 
There we go. Uh. Oh, game. Up. Ah, what is this star? <laughs> just going around collecting random stars now just to see what gives me what. Oh, okay. That was the roll in the cage one. Alright, now I gotta wait for the, the clock to hit the right time again. There's that one. One up there. That's four out of five that you can just see. Plus there's the one that I already got. That I already know of with the red coins. Oh, that was weird. I need to get up there. Ow! Didn't work how I thought, but it's okay. Oh, come on, game. Why did he do that? I do all kinds of fancy tricks, I can just jump up. <laughs> up. I don't know, you leave me alone. That. game ah. yes I still live
Camera! There we go. Ha ha ha. I don't know which one this is, but I got it. The pit and the pendulum. Oh, I thought it said penguins. <laughs> that's why. So that's three out of the four that I know of. So I wonder where the other, the last two are. Hmm. Come on. There we go. There's that. Ha ha! I don't know what star this is, but ha ha! <laughs> Time jumps on moving bars. Yeah, that's what I did. Alright, wait for the clock once again. I'll be right back. What's up here? Hmm. Oh, I could have jumped on that. Oh. Hold on, I'll be right back. I'm gonna re-enter this course. I think I could have jumped up on that um that block and gotten up. So I'll be back once I get back. So as I'm climbing back up, I got a question for people who actually watch this far in. Um, do you guys ever just sit there and play chess by yourself? Like, against yourself? To see if you can ever out, like, not outsmart yourself, but kind of find new ways to beat people who play like you. So recently, I've been playing a lot of chess on my own just to see... Like, I put myself in different situations by just playing normally and seeing ways that I can kind of get around it and, you know, stuff like that. And it's actually been kind of entertaining. You know, I never thought, one, I, I knew chess was, can be entertaining depending on how you play it or who you play with. But I never knew that you can actually kind of have fun playing on your own like that. It's actually... It's uh, more entertaining than I thought it was going to be, basically. But anyway, that that's my, my question for today's video. Do you guys just play chess on your own every now and then to see what's going on? See how you would think if you played against someone who had your own skills? Because I, I do now. Anyway, I'll catch you guys once I get all the way up there. Just wanted to ask that while I was going up. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> Definitely was not the way I was supposed to do that, but I don't care. I did it. <laughs>
There we go. Yeah. Easy final star. Nope. Yes! Here we go. That's how you do that without even having to change the time whatsoever. <laughs> cool. Well, that's all the stars from that world, right? Nah, I can just walk in. Yep, that's all of them. Well, with that... I believe that's the last world that we're gonna do before we open up this next uh, big door. Since there's two extra star, is it two or three? I think there's three extra stars that aren't a hundred coin stars. I'm not even gonna worry about doing them because I don't know where the other three stars are. However, oh two, no, it's two because there's that uh the flying world over there to the left. But, you know, there's only those those last two, maybe even one, depending on if you get a start from this last Bowser fight. But uh, I believe that's what this was behind this door. And uh, we'll see it next time we do Mario. So, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.